Well, ladies and gentlemen, for your viewing pleasure this afternoon, we've been out fungi foraging and got ourselves some parasol mushrooms. So I'm going to make that classic mushrooms on toast. Fried mushrooms on toast. There's some toast. I've toasted it. I'm going to leave it to dry out because obviously you get a bit of moisture with the mushrooms. First of all, get your knob of butter, nice and large. I'm going to whack that in the pan, let that melt down. Then my quartered, because these are quite small parasol mushrooms, are going to go in along with a bit of garlic, right at the end, parsley and lemon juice. So let's let that melt down. Medium heat, well, let's crack on. Right, the butter's nicely melted, a little bit bubbly. Stick in the garlic and let that brown a little. Garlic's bubbling away nicely now. I've turned it up to seven. This goes up to nine, so that gives you an idea of how much. Um, it's not a motorhead one, so it's not going up to 10. It's not gonna burn the butter or the garlic. So we put in our few handfuls of mushrooms. You don't wanna peel them, okay? That would ruin it. Let's give that a little shake around, okay? Leave them unpeeled, all right? There we go. Now, there's going to be a lot of moisture come out of these mushrooms as they cook. I'm going to drop it back down, actually. Sit on six. There'll be a lot of moisture come out of this, which we want to uh, evaporate to a degree. So you never do a massive batch, okay? When cooking mushrooms, go for a small batch so that they dry and aren't really sort of soggy because then you're just going to ruin your toast. The toast has been buttered and is waiting. I'm going to keep an eye on them. See, those ones are already browning off nicely and going limp and soggy. Okay, well, those ones are barely touched. Keep shaking, keep playing with it, keep turning. Right, it's all cooked down now. Parsley in, lemon, half a lemon there, squeeze it all over. Going to give it a little toss, going to stir, and a shake, rattle, and roll. Right, we're ready to serve up now. Straight onto the toast, look at that. What a gorgeous, gorgeous bit of grub that is.